You do not just become one of the richest people in the world without knowing something the rest of us don't. Often known as the Oracle of Oma, Warren Buffett has a net worth of over $100 billion, according to Forbes. While Buffett is unquestionably a genius when it comes to business, his words of wisdom aren't just good for finding a hot or a good investment deals. In fact, there are many Warren Buffett life tips or hacks that anyone can use to succeed in life, and they include the following. 1. Be a Contrarian Investor Buffett is what you would call a Contrarian Investor or just a value investor, meaning he's known for buying assets that aren't doing well and then selling them when they do perform. As he once wrote for the New York Times, be fearful when others are greedy and be greedy when others are fearful. Being a Contrarian or a value investor in life can take you far. Being a Contrarian requires identifying a company that will execute a plan to grow the business and at the same time has decent fundamentals so that if the plan takes longer to execute or if it doesn't work, you'll at least potentially have something of value that you could sell at a later date. You can follow this advice by being careful about where you spend your money and avoiding fads. 2. Start saving at a young age By age 15, Warren Buffett had earned $2,000 delivering papers and selling magazine subscriptions, according to CNBC. He used $1,200 of his earnings to invest in a farm, forming a profit-sharing agreement with the farmer. The lesson, start saving money as early as possible so that you get into the habit. This is important whether you're saving to invest in a business or buy your first house. Meanwhile consider subscribing and liking this video because it really helps the video in gaining traction and growth of the channel. Over 95% of my viewers are not subscribed yet my target is 100,000 subscribers in the near future. So please help me reach this target soon enough. Thank you very much. 3. Don't invest emotionally. Many investors have the urge to sell stocks when the market is down. However, a popular piece of Warren Buffett advice is to put your emotions aside when making business decisions. Reminding investors to keep their emotions in check, Buffett told Forbes, you're dealing with a lot of silly people in the marketplace, it's like a great big casino and everyone else is boozing. If you can stick with Pepsi, you should be okay. For best results in business and life, follow this Buffett tip and avoid making crucial decisions in the heat of the moment. 4. Reinvest your profits When Buffett was in high school, he and a friend bought a pinball machine. According to biography, the pair put it in a barber shop and quickly earned enough to buy more machines and install them in other shops. The friends eventually sold all the machines for a profit of $1,200. If you want your fortune to grow, the best thing you can do is keep reinvesting it in your business. Of course, you can enjoy the fruits of your labor, but don't spend it all in one place. 5. Communicate in person In 1951, when Buffett was looking for companies to invest in, he stumbled across Geico. To investigate further, he rode a train to the company's headquarters. Luckily, a top executive was there, and they had a meeting. Afterwards, Buffett made one of his earliest stock purchases invested in Geico. Today the insurance company is a subsidiary wholly owned by Berkshire Hathaway. Follow Buffett's advice and don't underestimate the value of face-to-face -face communication. When you're trying to achieve a business or personal goal, sometimes a phone call or email just won't cut it. 6. Graduate college early Because of Buffett's sharp mind for business, it's no surprise that he managed to finish college in three years, two at the Wharton School of Business and one at the University of Nebraska, according to the book Icons of Business. Although college costs weren't nearly as high in Buffett's day as they are today, it's likely that he saved money by completing his education in three years instead of four. Today's college students can save by following his lead. Therefore graduating early could save you even more when you factor in the cost of student loan interest paid out over the next 25 years. 7. Be true to yourself. Berkshire Hathaway is located in a fairly average-looking building in Omaha. But since Buffett is worth over $100 billion, many assume he works in more luxurious complexes. Your personal image is not the perception of how successful you are. Don't be someone you are not. Buffett owns who he is, a humble, grounded and notoriously frugal man. Flashy headquarters wouldn't suit him. You can follow this life hack by owning who you are. The people around you will view you as more authentic as a result. 8. Bounce back from rejection. Ironically, Harvard Business School rejected Buffett after his interview. But instead of sulking, he headed to Columbia and met Benjamin Graham. Graham is a legend in the investment industry, and he became Buffett's mentor. Much of Buffett's incredible investing success could arguably be credited to Graham and the lessons he taught him. Even if you get rejected from a school or job opportunity, it's important to keep moving forward. If Buffett had quit after Harvard dismissed him, he wouldn't be where he is today. 9. Leave frugally. Whatever your goals are in life, living frugally gives you the latitude to accomplish them. 
Unlike other billionaires who live lavish lifestyles, Buffett is known for living modestly. In fact, Munger said during the 2014 Berkshire Hathaway annual Q&A, frugality is basically how Berkshire happened. There are things money can't buy, Buffett said at the same event. I don't think standard of living equates with cost of living beyond a certain point. Good housing, good health, good food, good transport. There's a point you start getting inverse correlation between wealth and quality of life. My life couldn't be happier. In fact, it'd be worse if I had six or eight houses. 10. Be persistent. When Buffett graduated college, he wanted to work on Wall Street. He offered to work for his mentor Graham, but Graham said no. So, Buffett went back to Omaha, but he still continued to pitch ideas to Graham. Eventually, Graham hired Buffett. If you get a no from a potential employer who you really want to work with, never take it as a final answer. Keep trying until you get a yes. 11. Maintain good savings habits. According to the book Icons of Business, Buffett returned to Omaha when Graham closed his partnership. Luckily, he had his finances in order. By being a good saver and avoiding debt, Buffett grew his savings from $9,800 to $140,000. He then went on to create Buffett Associates Limited. Besides, when evaluating your cash flow, you should understand that the more revolving debt you carry, the more you will diminish the amount that can be invested. By saving money and avoiding debt you too can take advantage of business opportunity and pursue personal goals, such as retiring early. 12. Decide that you're going to be rich. In order to be rich, you have to believe that one day you will be. According to the Huffington Post, Buffett once reportedly said, I always knew I was going to be rich. I don't think I ever doubted it for a minute. For best results, set high expectations for yourself and work toward your goals and aspirations. Then, make it clear to yourself, your family and friends that you have a commitment to become financially independent. Create your future with a plan, knowing when to get aggressive against knowing when to be conservative. 13. Find a business partner. One could argue that Buffett wouldn't be successful without Charlie Munger, his billionaire right-hand man. According to The Economist, the pair met in 1959, and today Munger is the vice chairman of Berkshire Hathaway. Business Insider reported that Buffett once wrote, It took a powerful force to move me on from Graham's limiting views. It was the power of Charlie's mind. He expanded my horizons. Together, they took on some of Buffett's largest acquisitions, such as BNSF Corp. If you want to be successful, it's important to find a trusted partner, be it a business acquaintance, friend or spouse who challenges you to be better. 14. Invest in what you know. Buffett is famous for holding Coca-Cola stock. He purchased a 6.3% stake in the company in the late 1980s. As of July 18, 2017, he owned an 8.73% share in the soft drink company. Buffett certainly knows Coke well. He drinks up to five cans a day, and he once said, I'm one quarter Coca-Cola. You can follow this advice by pursuing a career about which you're truly passionate. Lastly, invest in yourself. Part of Berkshire Hathaway's success is due to the fact that Buffett put his money where his mouth was and invested in himself. If you want to succeed in business and life then you must invest in yourself. The best way to achieve wealth is always to pay yourself first, he said. Many people are currently doing this by investing through their company's retirement plan. If you develop the habit of always paying yourself first, you will be extremely successful in acquiring wealth. That being said, please guys subscribe and like this video because I am beginning to track when I will reach 100,000 subscribers in the near future. Meanwhile you can watch the two videos popping up on your screen.